When a pilot goes down over contested or enemy territory and forced to evade enemy capture, it is the job of elite Air Force units to come to their rescue so that others may live. Air Force units undergo exercises to ensure that if an airman is forced to bail out in war, they can survive, evade, resist, and escape enemy hands. For the first time, units in Northern California from Beale Air Force Base and Moffett Field put this training to the test with a combat search and rescue exercise involving a downed U-2 pilot. As the downed airmen seek shelter and called in for recovery, insurgent forces closed in on his position and captured the pilot. It was then that a U-2 Dragon Lady, RQ-4 Global Hawk, and an MC-12 Liberty were called in for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance support to assist in locating the downed pilot and enemy forces. With real-time imagery and intelligence support overhead, it was now the job of an elite group of airmen to find and recover the captured pilot, neutralize enemy forces, and bring him back home safe. The exercise was the first of its kind, involving support from all of Beale's ISR assets to support a personnel recovery operation. Taking advantage of Beale's weapon systems proved successful in an operation that normally is carried out by other conventional Air Force units. Airman Drew Buchanan, reporting from Beale Air Force Base, California.